What's going on, everybody? It's your boy. I'm here to give you guys this week's tabloids and trending topics with T. Before we get into everything, church announcements. <laughs> Got to do it. Uh, first, I know y'all probably see that this is late. Well, being uploaded. The reason being is, if you, like, if you guys don't watch my reviews, I've actually been in class for like the last week. Started on what the fifth, and. Class doesn't end until the 20th, which I think is either Friday or Saturday. And it has been literally, like, information the fuck overload. We just took our written exam on... Well, first off, we all had it, like, first day we sat down. We walked into a test. Everybody fucking failed. <laughs> but everybody passed the retest. Then we had our written exam on Friday, two days ago. And out of 21 people, only two passed. I was one of the two. And the fucked up thing is, it was an open book test. That's what made this shit crazy. But it was, it was difficult. Like, I didn't even think I was going to pass. So, like, a lot of my time I was going to that. That's why I haven't done my Little Women Atlanta or Mary's Medicine review. The Little Women, because I was preparing for that test. And the Mary's Medicine, because I was having a celebratory drink. Because I was either going to have a celebratory drink or a War With Me drink. <laughs> it just happened to be celebratory. But I, I've actually been spending time just trying to gather up topics for it, this um, segment. So that's the first thing. Uh, second thing, videos again might be a little bit delayed because I have one more test to do as an oral exam, which is going to be the most difficult because it's actually a piece of software where a lot of questions are going to come from and we can't open it. We've got to recall the shit from memory. So I'm going to be devoted to that. I'll try to get the reviews out as timely as I possibly can. It's going to be difficult. And then after the 20th, when the class is over, you know, praying, hands up to the graduate, I go right into a rotation. And that's going to take me all the way into the very beginning of February. So I do have somebody I'm going to be partnered with. I haven't met the gentleman yet. And I won't be, I won't meet him until after the 20th. So we got to figure out if we're going to do 12 on, 12 off, or 24 on, 24 off. If we do, if we do 24 on, 24 off, I'll be able to give you guys videos barely. If not, then you guys just won't get videos until the first, which means that it's gonna be a multiple upload kind of day. But then that means that this segment, we, we gonna be here for a minute. <laughs> so it just is what it is. So church announcements. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the, the show, if you will. Of course, we always have to start by, you know, giving flowers. So first, let's get Will soon to Los Angeles Clippers. Blake uh, Griffin, he suffered a concussion against Golden State. Um, it was the first quarter of the game, and pretty much uh, he, it was an accidental elbow to his head. He fell, and uh, yeah. So it's suffering a concussion. So definitely, you know, get Will soon. Hopefully a speedy recovery, you know, and yeah. Pretty sure that had to have been hard. Um, let me see. Also, get well soon to a WWE uh, wrestler Paige. Um, she has been forced to retire. So this is actually get well soon and just literally just sending out prayers because of the neck injury. So get well soon, but also because of this neck injury, she's been forced to retire. So she won't be able to wrestle anymore. I will say that I don't think this is it for her because there are a lot of people in the WWE who don't wrestle or can't wrestle that actually um, do a lot of work behind the scenes. So maybe just maybe she can be, you know, one of the many wrestlers on a female side to kind of help with, you know, uh, teaching, you know, the up and coming females. So hopefully there's still some of the four and she's only 25. So, wow. And last that I have is London-born model Harry uh, Uzoka. Hopefully I'm saying his name right. He um, was 25 and he uh, lost his life. Uh, pretty much uh, two gentlemen uh, stabbed him to death. And it said that it's a robbery gone wrong. Uh, as of right now, I don't think they have any suspects just yet. But like I said, he is a, uh, you know, huge uh, superstar. Not superstar. Uh, London model. And he uh, lost his life at the age of 25. So again, you guys, just don't forget in life in general, 
you know, if they're still breathing, give people their flowers while they're living, because, like I said, can't do anything when they're gone.